box is surprisingly big for what I expect to see in here. Right, standard manual. I'm actually not even going to open this. I'm going to save the box and everything and use the online manual. That way it stays all for pristine. Like this is the face, face plate. Feels really solid. Plasticky, but solid. Okay, now this piece here is surprisingly small. And granted, the faceplate goes on there, but this piece is heavy, but small. It's got the stand for it. And I'm guessing. Plugs in here. I think it goes. It's got some arrows on the top, and it slides. It goes over and that way. Okay. I don't like how far these stick out, and the only reason is because I feel like if I put it in a bag and it bangs it. I had a Yaesu 897, and after several years, this knob got wobbly. Now, I was able to find a way to. I took the rubber off, and I was able to find a key. And tighten it but it was never the same after it got wobbly so I wouldn't want to bang bang it like that I kind of want some protection and get those protective bars that go go like that okay what else is in the box Our cord I wonder if there's one or two here okay there's one fuses this is for a car mount brackets and screws which I'm not going to use the microphone which I will use. Yep, it's just like my old Yezu microphone, very basic. Switch on the back for tone tone switch. I always recommend saving your boxes and manuals. If you ever sell it, it will break, keep the value higher and you can put it all back the way it was. And I think you'll get more out of it. Test. First time ever. Never connected this. This power cord is way too long. I'm gonna have to zip tie it. Right. There we go. It's got good connectors there, it looks like. I'm going to go ahead and zip tie this. Just take the cover off. almost hate to do that, but it's going to have to happen eventually. have an antenna hooked up so I'm gonna be careful not to do anything. Here we go. Interesting. Hold it down. Lesson learned. Now I had an old 897 the first radio. don't remember it. Now there is a tension knob under here and my uh, ICOM has that same thing. You can slide it to the right or left to make it easier to spin. This is definitely not a how-to and I don't mean to... This is just a look and feel video just to see if I hit band. Uh, this is a look and feel first first time use. I don't know how to move move over. Let's see band. And that's all I'm gonna do. This is not a how-to. I just want to see if I can get it working. It's it's tinier than I thought. When you see this on the videos, here's a pair of scissors. That little screen is tinier than I thought. 
because you see it on a video it looks bigger than it is but it's not and that's okay because the whole thing is compact and that's what I want I can't believe that I don't know but this is the the smallest 100 watt radio that I know of that I know of I'm sure there there might be others but this is the one I wanted looks really good <laughs> 